was in shock when I heard what had happened. I couldn't believe that. I mean, I was here the day that it happened. I pulled up and the cops were, the police were all here. Neighbors are shocked after a 13 year old boy was kidnapped at gunpoint in their neighborhood. That child is safe tonight and Greece police have arrested and charged these three men. New tonight, News 10 NBC's Marsha Augustin spoke with neighbors at the Greece apartment complex where the boy was held. So this is the apartment complex where police say the 13 year old was abducted. And that's not all. These court documents say the three men forced him to take off his clothing, threatened to shoot him, cut off his hair and handcuffed him. I seen bikes on the ground. I seen uh, SUV that was every door on the car was opened and they had it blocked off. You couldn't even get by. And then I heard that there was a kidnapping. Neighbors say the details are quite disturbing. Police say these three men, from left to right, 22-year-old Myquan Williams, 25-year-old Jaquan R. Martin, and 53-year-old Lennis Williams threatened to shoot the 13-year-old with a loaded rifle, abducted him, forced him into Jaquan Martin's apartment for about 45 minutes, made him get undressed, cut his hair off, smashed his iPhone and handcuffed him. I'm disgusted. I mean, we have kids around here that play out in these streets, you know, and ride their bikes and go to school. And it's just, it's awful. I cannot even believe that something like this even happened. That's crazy. Why? Who, who would do such a thing? That's Ariana Santiago. She also lives in Glenora Gardens and is at a loss for words. I shared some of the details of the kidnapping in the court documents with her. While restrained in handcuffs, police say the three men also forced the child into a car where he sat in the back seat with one of them to prevent him from escaping. That's appalling. That's why would you do that to somebody? Why a kid? That's there's no. He ain't deserve that. To put that poor kid through that is awful. I feel for him and I pray for him and his family. Police confirmed the child did not know the three men prior to the kidnapping. Police did not confirm why the boy was targeted in the first place.